Hello everybody, it's Stranger Gamer back for another Master Right Tournament. And in this pool A clash, we have Team Europe squaring off against the Euraptor team. I mean, not much to be said here, so let's crack on with it. And in the red corner, for Team Europe, we have the Megalosaurus. Posting them. Well, we, you know the move, Seth. Very nice. Been a bit mixed fortune for Team Europe. One win and two defeats in the opening three games. Backing up the Megalosaurus, we have the Camptosaurus. Revival type. Which means if it dies in a tie, it gets to come back once. So yeah, as I said, mixed fortunes for the Meg Europe team. But in the blue corner, I think quite happy for the poor little guy, but we have the Yorah. What will it transform into this time? Ooh, Lambiosaurus! That means it will have a new set of Nature's Blessing and Bigfoot Assault. Nope, two platoon to crush. Two platoon crush and Bigfoot Assault. And backing up the Eoraptor, we have the Sejuanosaurus, also revival time. So I come to Saurus, if it dies in a time, it has to come back once. Hasn't quite happened for the Eoraptor team so far, although they've put in impressive displays, but they've just come up short in a few more matches. But can they get over the line this time? I mean, I like to think that each team will get at least one thing in my tournament. <laughs> so can Eoraptor get his first win of the tournament? But it's not a good start, because the Megalosaurus gets the hit on. You know, I'll stun a damage because your actor is frail. Oh, we have a tie. Oh, but your actor gets the swap out and a critical move to boot. And it's, yep, as I said, it's big for the song. Oh, this could be interesting because. Eoraptor has the highest technique in the game, which means 9 times out of 10 is going to get a support effect off every time this Sejuanosaurus hits. And that support effect will heal the Sejuanosaurus, so it could be interesting. Oh, we have a tie. So Eoraptor heals up its health. Ooh, it's so strong a source gets a hit on. As the tappy jar is coming for tiebreaker. And the top is it no dino swing. Like it would swing that thing. And the Megalosaurus goes down. Oh, there's no support for that. Okay. Team Eel Raptor on top at the minute. And the Sejuan will have the type of battle. Jaws going for the tiebreaker. Oh, we have another tie. Oh, and the Sejuan gets a big hit on. And the biting wind activates. We could be looking at your after first win of the tournament. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh I've never done that before. The ear after the cure was fully healed. Shows how frail it is. Well, but the Campasaurus strikes back, not going down without a fight. As the light recovery comes into play. And this is Metal Wing. So the Pteranodon's coming in. Might be moderate damage. Yeah. Oh, the Campasaurus gets another hit off. Put up a very impressive fight. Yeah! And Nature's Blessing activates. Oh, we have a tie. Tappy Jars are still going in for that tiebreaker. Oh, 
Bigfoot from the Camposaurus taking out Sejuan. And he will get a hit on the Eeyore after as well. Oh, this makes things interesting. Oh, the Camposaurus gets another hit off. Not doing much damage, to be honest. It's not going to come back. Look at this all of a sudden. Oh, I think that's Camposaurus out. <laughs> and the ER Active Team will claim its first win of the tournament on the fourth time of Asuka. It won't be a bonus point win, but it'll be a win nonetheless. At least gets them off the board. The Oracta takes the win, defeating Team Europe. So I hope you enjoyed this match, and I'll see you next time.